And the next tip is to use the boundary command. Yes. So for instance, I would like to draw an outline over here that goes around my elevation building to add a color so it can print darker, right? And the way we can do it more effectively, instead of, you know, drawing a polyline around like so, that's a waste of time, right? So let's not do that. And let's use the boundary command. So let's draw a rectangle really quick. And I'm going to draw a rectangle from here all the way up to here, like so. And then what I'm going to do is uh, use the BO for the shortcut. That's the shortcut for the boundary command. And over here, let's pick the polyline option. Make sure that's selected and click OK. So at this point, I can click inside the rectangle like so. And you can see that it will generate automatically an outline or boundary. So at this point, I can press Enter. And I will have this like so. So at this point, what I can do is simply use the Trim command. And I will trim, of course, this part. And then I will trim this other part like so. And then I will erase my rectangle. And then I will have also erase this object. And then I will have my outline like so quickly and easy. So at this point, I can change layers or I can do, you know, whatever I want. And you will have your outline quickly and easily like so. Great, right? That's a quick and more productive way to generate outlines uh, here inside the AutoCAD program. So use that technique.